in your new document first of all click tools site manager file manager create a new folder called images highlight that folder and then click add file browse to your contact image and click OK next you need to go to the template file that I sent you and copy the HTML segment at the top then go back to your document and paste in place next go back to the template right click off the page click attach HTML copy everything from where it says page body end right the way down to just before the end of the body go back to your new document right click off the page click attach HTML scroll down to where you see page body end click and paste the text next go back to the uh, your new document and preview it in a window it won't actually send the mail at this stage but you can see what it's going to look like there we go okay go back to your document we now need to get your serif ID to send the email so create a new document insert a blank form right click and click edit form properties just give the form any name tell it to go to serif at web at resources select the email address you want to receive the contact it may take a few seconds to come up select the email click OK and click OK again then right click the form and click attach HTML Bra uh, scroll down until you see where it says user ID or UID what you need is that long number after the UID equals so copy that then go back to your new document right click attach HTML and where it says your user ID paste that number you'll need to change the thank you page to the page that you're going to use for thank you and you'll also want to change the visit us address and name at the top of the form as shown here okay we've done that now go back to the document right click the the HTML segment at the top and scroll down and there is where you change the color of the background of the contact form just put the color code into that position there there's one last thing we need to do and that's add the email validation script so we go to tools site manager file manager click on WP scripts click add file browse to where you've installed your serif x5 this is usually C program files serif web plus x5 then go to internet javascript and select the JS validation script that's it you've done now you can publish your page and the email will be sent